everyone, what is up? I hope you guys are having a great break if you guys are on break from school. I hope it has been well. I hope you guys did have a Merry Christmas and a Happy Holiday. So today I am going to be doing what I got for Christmas. These videos are always super fun to watch, but more importantly, I love looking back on like what I got last year and what I thought was just like the coolest thing ever and then like now it's kind of out of style. This year, Wayne and I recently got married and we are currently living in Canada. Yeah. So this Christmas was obviously a little bit different for us. We left right after Thanksgiving, which was the end of November. So before we left, my family got together and did a mini Christmas celebration at our house, which was so much fun. I'm really glad we were able to do something before we left. So we were actually kind of gifted some presents then, and most of those presents were geared towards our move and our house and stuff, which we were so thankful for, and I am like so stoked about a lot of the stuff we got, um, as well as Wayne and I had <laughs> <laughs> about five presents to open up on Christmas Day. If you guys have not seen our vlogs from moving and Vlogmas and into Christmas Day, then I will link our vlog channel down below. Definitely go check those out. It has been such a funny journey so far. Um, <laughs> yeah, it's it's been great and definitely one to remember but we were able to open up some gifts on Christmas day. So I'm just gonna go ahead and jump into the video and I hope you guys enjoy. Of course, I do wanna put out there that I'm not trying to brag about anything I got. So one of the first things that we got for Christmas, I'm um, back with my family, this was before we left. I was super excited to get this because I was nervous we weren't gonna have a tree up here. Our place came with this little thing honestly not sure what it is not really a christmas tree but it's like a green thing with lights on it but so my grandma and grandpa gave us this mini christmas tree right here although it does not look many <laughs> it comes with just this little battery pack and the lights turn on and stuff so it's super cute honestly these are the things that i love because so we had this for our first christmas and i'm so looking forward to one day like having this on our like 10th Christmas and it's just like still kicking it and still going strong. So I am so thankful that my grandparents got us this and this was our little Christmas tree in our bedroom this year so we really enjoyed this. Another thing I got when I was home um, before we left was this necklace right here. So it has beads and then it goes into kind of a tassel effect like it's made out of feathers but it's super cute and does hang long. It's kind of orange, yellow, and creamish. So I really like stuff like this. Wayne and I were actually fortunate enough to go and visit my in-laws, Wayne's parents and Wayne's family before Thanksgiving, about like two weeks before Thanksgiving or so. So we were actually able to kind of celebrate it with them and then see them one last time before we made our move up here. And, <laughs> okay, so they live in Houston, Texas, and there's this thing called the Nutcracker Market. I've never heard of it before, but if you're from Texas, you probably have, but it's this huge warehouse that they're just like full of shops and stuff, and that's where most people I feel like would do their Christmas shopping just because you can almost find anything you want there. It's crazy. And so, anywho, Wayne's mom and sisters always have like the cutest purses, and they told me it was this brand that like you can only buy at those Christmas markets and it's a really nice leather brand of bags. So we were there and they had the shop and so part of Wayne's parents Christmas present to me, <laughs> that's like a mouthful to say. Um, yeah, so my in-laws got me this black leather bag. I love it. Oh, and if you guys wanna see a what's in my bag, I would love to do one. I'm currently having two bags because I don't know why, but this is the one I use every single day. I seriously love it. So this is what it looks like. It has the two straps up here, fringe on both sides, and it's literally just like this big bottomless pit that I just throw stuff in. And this bag is like the softest thing ever. I seriously love it. This is a bag where like, it can easily go with like sweatpants or dressed up or like, I, I just, I, 
like I'm surprised how much I just love this bag and like I knew I was gonna love it which is why I picked it out but I have not wanted to change it since like we went out to a fancy restaurant and like I brought this <laughs> because I just love it so much so this is one thing that they got me I am not sure what the brand oh McFadden yeah handmade in Texas McFadden bags um, they are a little bit on the pricier side, but once you guys feel them, like, you'll understand why. Like, this thing is not gonna break. Like, it is so sturdy, and it's just the nicest leather ever. So, in the future, I would love to get, like, they have, like, this is obviously, this is, like, their medium size. They have, like, a bigger one, a smaller one. They have, like, thousands of bags, like, y'all. Like, you have to check it out. But, um, yeah, so they got me this, which I love. I, like, yeah, I don't know. I'm, like, crazy obsessed with it, but that's okay. I guess that's never a bad thing. <laughs> Another thing that I got for Christmas this year is something that we do every single year and it is a tradition in our family and that is on Christmas Eve we get pajamas so Wayne and I really wanted to carry that tradition over to our family so this year these are the pajamas I got they are onesies <laughs> they're gonna be so hard to show but um so basically the pattern is all these trees and there are some reindeer like peeking through in some of the trees and stuff. There, it's such a cute pattern. The cutest thing about this is the butt. <laughs> it has these little, the flaps where like you could take it down and go to the bathroom. Um, but it says no peeking with this reindeer, which is so cute. And this is like one of the comfiest onesies I own and it fits perfectly. I was so excited to open it up Christmas Eve and I've worn it almost every night since I just like lounge around in it and then change when I actually go to bed because I would get way too hot in this thing but um yes it is super cute and I just love the pattern and stuff so this was my pajamas I before I go into what I got while I was in Canada my parents and family did get us a lot of other stuff although some things are gonna be like really hard to show on here um, we got like some picture frames with our wedding photos in them. Um, we got a crock pot, which I'm super excited about. We also got our wedding book, which actually arrived today. So let me go get that. It is a white creamish color on the outside. And again, this is like really nice leather, so it will hold up. It is a 12 by 12, I believe, which is like huge, y'all. Like literally, look at it compared to my face. Like this thing's huge. So obviously when you open it and you lay it flat, the spread is like 24 by 12. Huh, it's huge, but I love it. So like moving kind of along to things I can show you, and these are kind of things we got while we are here in Canada. The first thing is just something super simple, and this will be in a video coming up, so I'm not gonna talk too much about it, but it is just rose water. So Wayne got me a new wallet for Christmas, which I'm so stoked about. So it was actually from this really nice leather store here on the island in like the downtown area. Um, and I actually got one for Wayne too from Wayne's parents, my in-laws, and it is this iPad. So they did get me an iPad mini too. I absolutely love it. I have like totally played around with it recently and I love it. Like sometimes I just don't want to hassle with my big computer and like that's when I use this. Also, it's super easy to like respond to emails and I, I've just like loved this thing. So that is all I got for Christmas this year. I'm sorry I wasn't able to show you guys everything, but that was kind of the gist of stuff. It was a great first Christmas for Wayne and I. So many memories were made. Um, again, all of that's on my vlog channel, so definitely go watch that. I hope you guys had a great Christmas and happy holidays. Um, definitely such a great time to just be with family and friends. I'm super stoked to see where I'm at next Christmas and kind of what my life is then. I hope you guys have a great rest of December and a great start to 2017. I'm so excited for 2017. It is going to be such an awesome year. I have so many goals and um, a video on 2017 is coming soon. Love y'all. God bless. Bye.